We're going to be using a lot of functions in MATLAB in this course. Functions will be written using a fixed width font like the one currently displayed on the screen. Functions in MATLAB can have inputs and outputs. They don't have to, but most of them do. Basic syntax for a function is shown on the screen. The left of the equal sign is the output or outputs of a function. Inputs to a function are shown in between the parentheses after the function name. As we will see, some inputs are optional. This will be listed in italics. If you do not enter a value for these, MATLAB will use a default value. As an example, a function that we have been using is clearvars to clear variables in the workspace. Notice that clearvars is a function that does not require any inputs. So I will introduce the function with the syntax shown on the screen. Now every function in MATLAB is extensively documented. If you do not remember the syntax or if you just want to know the specifics of how a function works, you can use the help function. The syntax is help followed by a space followed by the function name. For this function, you do not need to use parentheses to input the function name. All right, let's switch over to MATLAB. Now to get the documentation for the clearvars function, you can enter help space clearvars into the command window. And MATLAB will then print some help to the command window. It can be pretty long. So let's scroll up. You can see here at the very top that if you enter clearvars on its own, MATLAB will remove all variables from the workspace. Now it turns out that there are many ways that you can use this function. You can also just clear specific variables by tapping in the names of the variables, or you can delete all variables except some specific ones by using the minus except flag. Now this help text is meant to be a quick reference, but sometimes it can be difficult to read. So if you want a nicer presentation, you can use the doc function. The doc function has the syntax doc space function name. Now going back to our previous example, if we type in doc clearvars, a new window will appear that contains an HTML document. And MATLAB does a pretty good job here of documenting both the syntax, descriptions, and examples of how to use a function. Please use the help and doc functions as much as you need. For the most part, we will not be testing whether or not you remember the syntax for a function. Instead, it is much more important that you know how a function works, and you can get that from the document. You can also use the help function on operators such as dot star. Okay, one little tip. I strongly suggest that you start making a list of the functions that we encounter. In the past, students have requested that I provide a list. However, I think it is much more instructive for you to compile your own. This will help you in remembering the functions that we are using. To start you off, here is a list of the functions that we have encountered so far. DLC to clear the command window. Clear vars to clear variables in the workspace. Pi to retrieve the value of pi. And of course, help and doc to access the documentation. 